You've probably heard of HPV, but did you know it's so common that almost every sexually active woman will get it at some point? The scary part? You might not have symptoms, but it could still lead to cervical or vaginal cancer if undetected. Hi friends, Dr. Emily here, an OBGYN here in the US and a straightforward voice of science-backed truth here on YouTube. In this episode of Vaginal Health 101, we're breaking down everything you need to know about HPV in women, especially how it affects your vagina and cervix, what it is, how it spreads, how it's linked to cancer, and most importantly, how to protect yourself. What is HPV? HPV, or human papillomavirus, is the most common sexually transmitted infection in the world. There are over 100 types of HPV, and at least 14 are considered high risk because they're linked to cancer. Some types cause genital warts, others lead to changes in your cervical and vaginal cells, and that's where the danger lies. How do you get HPV? HPV is spread through skin-to-skin -skin contact, most often during vaginal, anal, or oral sex. You don't have to have intercourse to get it. Just contact with the genital area is enough. Most people don't know they have it. There are usually no visible symptoms unless genital warts appear or you have an abnormal pap smear. What HPV does to the vagina? HPV can cause cellular changes in the cervix, vagina, and vulva. And if not detected early, it can lead to cervical dysplasia, precancerous changes, pervasional intraepithelial neoplasia, vein, cervical cancer, fingenal cancer, rare but possible. Symptoms of advanced disease can include regular vaginal bleeding, foul-smelling discharge, pelvic pain. But in early stages, HPV is completely silent, and that's why regular screening is essential. Diagnosis. Pap smear checks for abnormal cells on the cervix. HPV DNA testing looks for high-risk strains. Recommending starts at age 21 and co-testing from age 30 to 65. Prevention. He HPV vaccine, like Gardasil 9, protects against nine common cancer-causing and wart-causing types. Bash test given before sexual activity, but can still be useful up to age 45. Treatment. There's no cure for the virus itself, but your immune system can clear it naturally in most cases. We treat abnormal cells or warts, not HPV itself. Lifestyle support. Quit smoking. Eat antioxidant-rich foods. Reduce stress. If you've ever had an abnormal pap smear, don't panic. It doesn't mean you have cancer. It just means we caught something early. Most HPV infections clear within one to two years. What matters is monitoring, vaccination, and trusting your OBGYN. Have you or someone you know had HPV or an abnormal pap? Leave a message or just type HPV awareness. The more we talk about it, the more lives we can save. And remember to like, subscribe, and turn on the bell so you never miss an important women's health episode with Dr. Emily.